Hi guys, this is Katja with Creators Image Studio. I am so excited guys because I have a completely new uh, project for you and it's not even the design here because this is a box card and you know this design. There are many people who have created these. Um, and me as well, by the way. I even have tutorial for how to create them in my Etsy shop. But be that as it may, what is unique and new about this is that I designed this design paper, well, sort of. I have to be clear about this. I bought a digital scrapbooking kit and it is called Bring On Summer by Savvy Designs. And I designed a double-sided sheet of paper with all of the digital elements, combining them just so. Now, what makes this card unique, or actually the design of the paper, I have to say, uh, you see that I did not use any cardstock. Now, as you know, with these box cards, you put them in the envelope like this, right? So here you can see the design of the outside, and here you can write your message. But you, you know, you have to, when you open it, fold it like this. So with normal double-sided paper, with the normal patterns, if you have a double-sided paper without cardstock and you would fold it like this, this would be upside down, right? If I show you like this, you can see what I mean. So this is not upside down because this is the butterfly. And now this is. So in one sheet of paper, I designed it just so. So you don't need any cardstock and you just have to uh, cut a little bit here and stick it together here. And that's it. You have a complete box card. I also uh, created some uh, cut apart sheets to create these here. So the only thing I used here is this paper that I uh, came up with and uh, some glue, etc. So no cardstock at all and no extra embellishments because all embellishments are actually in the paper. Well, I did stamp it here, hooray for you because I left a space here to stamp. Now, this collection that I mentioned, Bring On Summer by Savvy Designs, it is for personal use only, so I cannot sell you this, but I can add it uh, to something else as a freebie, which is what I'm gonna do. But I did uh, buy some commercial use kits after this one, and I came up with another paper. So here it is. So here you can see what I mean, guys. So this would be the outside of your, uh, your uh, box card. So like this, see? And now for the other side, there you go. Okay, and here it is. So this is what you are going to make with the uh, printable sheet that I just showed you. Isn't it great? I'm calling this sheet flowers and wine. So flowers and wine, so it has uh, lots of flowers as you can see. It also has some grapes. So there's the, the wine theme and of course a glass of wine. Here's some grapes again. And I did some stamping here. It says time to celebrate. Uh, you can do that if you want, you don't have to. And this is a stamp also, Proficiat which is congratulations in Dutch. And uh, look how gorgeous this is with the cut apart sheets and the dimensional elements that I added. And uh, well, if you like, you could add some glitter glue. You can write your message here. And then when you wanna send it in an envelope, you simply fold it flat like that and you put it into an envelope. So very simple. So there you go. So let's have them next to each other. So, don't you like it? Don't you love it? I love it, guys. This is my own printed paper. And I will make this available for you for a very, very small price. And you can print it as many times as you like, but you cannot sell it, guys, because it is for personal use, for your personal use. So, uh, there you go. So, I hope you like this idea. I am uh, thinking very hard about other designs that I can uh, accommodate with this kind of design uh, of paper. So, so this uh, is my to-do list for the coming months to uh, get myself uh, acquainted with all of this graphic design stuff. But for now, this will be in my Etsy shop for you to download as a printable. So, you will need a, a color uh, printer. 
and this is a photo printer actually print paper I mean printing paper not the glossy kind but the matte kind that is important because the glossy kind has a different texture on the on the other side it's, it's meant to be printed on one side only so buy your matte photo paper guys uh, for this uh, to work out best now so this was this will be in my Etsy shop uh, to print um, you will also get the cut apart sheet so there you go well, I hope you uh, really like this idea and to, uh, as a bonus for you guys, you will get with this very first project of mine, my, my first graphic design digital printable project, you will get this sheet with the cut apart sheet for free added to this one. So this will be a freebie and you can see here how that would work. So that is my opening offer, as it were, because I'm starting something new. So I will let you uh, have the advantages of that as well. Uh, so this is the freebie that you get. And uh, if you want some instructions, uh, there is a tutorial for a box card in general that I added a bonus tutorial to for this printable here for the Bring On Summer and a free bonus cutting guide for this one because there are slight tiny differences in measurements as to where you have to cut uh, etc but it's just tiny so this is a cutting guide for this one a bonus tutorial for that one all with no extra cost with my box card tutorial which is in itself not expensive at all so uh, there's a lot of bang for your buck guys now these these will be in my printable section because there will be some printables uh, coming months for all kinds of stuff. There's already a, a printable uh, booklet and you can check out the, the video of that uh, booklet. For the experienced crafter, I think if you just eyeball it, I mean, this is how I designed it, just eyeballing it. So experienced crafters can create a box card simply by printing this paper. And meanwhile, I will be making uh, normal paper projects, of course, that will be the main element of my channel. Uh, for a long time but uh, this will be hopefully a welcome addition uh, for you all even if it were only because these papers you can buy nowhere else because they are uniquely designed so let me know what you think about my new uh, adventure that i started here the designing the graphic designing of specialty papers designed uh, to uh, create these uh, special cards. By the way, you don't have to create a box card, of course, you can do other things. For instance, I created a tag and that is actually this part here. So you see, so this is ideal for a tag. You can write some things on it. And of course the size also is perfect. Same goes for this one here or for the other parts. And uh, with this paper here, I also created a hidden hinge binding for an album of mine. So you can actually print your own paper and you can print it as often as you like, as long as it's for personal use. So thank you for watching. Let me know what you think in the comment section. Press the like, the thumbs up to like my video and press the large red button to subscribe to my channel and never miss any of my videos any again. Also press the bell sign for, uh, to get notifications when new videos are up. All right, see you next time and thank you for watching. Bye bye.